With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, the question given is which of the following pairs of elements would have more negative electron gain enthalpy? Okay, so let's see. Uh, we have electron gain enthalpy that is delta H E Z. So we need to check where this delta E Z will be more negative. So this delta E Z that is, that, that is electron gain enthalpy will be more negative when we have electron affinity maximum. Okay, if electron affinity maximum, then we can say that our delta H E Z will be minimum or we can say more negative. Now, we have to check with the help of electron affinity. Now, we know that if we want to check electron affinity, okay, then what we need to do? Now, we know that from left to right, from left to right, electron affinity will increase. Okay, from left to right, electron affinity will increase, then obviously delta H E Z will decrease. So the value of delta H E Z will be more negative when we go from left to right because of the Z effect, okay? Or we can say because of the electronegativity. So what will happen? So we have uh, we have elements, we have carbon and we have silicon, okay? And we have oxygen and we have nitrogen and we have oxygen. Okay, here we have nitrogen and here we have oxygen and here we have sulfur, okay? And and what we have? We have fluorine and we have chlorine. Okay, these elements are given in the question. Okay, now we are going from left to right. Okay, this is left and here we are right from left to right. Now when we go from left to right, that means we know that from left to right, electron affinity will increase. If electron affinity will increase, that means delta H E Z will decrease. So that's why more negative value of delta E Z for chlorine and fluorine because Chlorine and from chlorine and, and fluorine will be uh, more in, in right side. So when we go from left to right side, then what will happen? Electron negativity will increase. So electron gain enthalpy means any electron, okay, any atom. Suppose we have fluorine, so fluorine will accept the electron, accept the electron, okay. If electron negativity of fluorine will be more, that means this electron can easily be attracted by the fluorine, or we can say easily gain by fluorine. Similarly for chlorine, chlorine is also more electron negative. So it will also accept the electron very easily. So that's why fluorine and chlorine having maximum electron affinity or we can say more negative electron gain enthalpy because of their high electron negativity. Okay, so when we go from left to right, basically electron negativity will increase. If electron negativity will increase, then we can say electron affinity will also increase. Okay, and if electro electron affinity will increase, then we can say delta H E Z, that is electron gain enthalpy will be more negative. So Electron gain enthalpy will be more negative for fluorine and chlorine. That means which option is correct? Option here, option B, fluorine and chlorine. Option B should be our answer, and rest of the others are correct. Okay, wrong. So the correct option is fluorine or chlorine. That means option B should be our answer. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.